Alright, I'm gonna get the rest of the CG art here. How strong are the enemies here now? Do they power up ever since last time? I don't think so. Hmm. Yeah, this should not be too difficult. But at the same time, they probably won't drop very, very good uh, nodes. Oh no, does this control the water level? Is this a water level stage? Hmm. Spikes. I right, hope I'm going to uh, hope uh, this uh, hope this puzzle isn't too difficult. Probably will be. And there's the Hagen, which is strangely weak to water. We really need a scan ability. Oh no, some more spikes. So that's the entrance to the room. More a nurse switch. Why is there an enemy just sitting here? It's just a nurse of Hagen. Weird. Some of the enemies get stuck on tiles they cannot move from. It's really weird. Ah, oh, monster node. Good, good. But what else am I looking for here? Okay, that's what I split the switch, so that means the spikes on the other side should be down. And there's a crystal on the north switch. Hmm. More money. I don't know why some crystals have a full free healing while others don't. It's really weird. What's the de what's the reason behind this design? Well, I guess it's at least it's better than uh, Tales of Symphonia, which at least in this uh, the early stage doesn't have any healing uh, uh, save points. Okay. Oh, another save point. Just how far down am I going? Ooh, nice. Nice wipe out there. Oh. Sort of Mayani, what the heck is that? It's not that powerful. Oh well. Another super healing crystal. I'm sure it would be nice if there was a teleport crystal to uh, get to the t entrance of the cave, at least. Uh... This place just goes on pretty long. I think I saw a super rare in there. Chaka's healing water. Wait, I think I saw something on the 
Was there another path on the other side? Where does it go? Oh, spikes. Hmm. They have no choice but to fight whatever's on the other side here. More monster nodes. Maybe they really intend for you to get all uh, buy all the ultimate weapons uh, with this kind uh, with this money. Yeah, that's why they're being so generous now. Now it makes sense. Of course, I already have all the ultimate weapons. What's waiting for me at the bottom? This is not required for the story at all. If I wanted to, I could end the story right now just by talking to Sir Magid. And... I don't think I've seen any red chests yet. What's going on? I probably should have come here earlier while the enemies were still a reasonable challenge. And so I could get more money. Huh, there seems to be a safe crystal over there, so that means this middle section might have a switch. What the heck? Do we have to insert something into that uh, monument? Oh, the water has gone down. Nice. Oh, there's even a bunch of treasure here. Now, if I can just figure out how to get down there, that would be great. Wait, did the, did the enemies respawn? It could be that uh, toggling the water level caused all the enemies to respawn as well. Because like it's like being transferred onto a different map. No, that wouldn't be right. Would it? You can only open this box when you've collected all 31. Okay, so I need one more. Let's see. That, that's what the water level is for. I need to explore old areas and see if there's any n new paths for me. Huh. Weird. Ah, crap, they all respawned. Okay, now we can get under here. Let's see. There must be another CG here, right? What the? What is this place? Yes, Fields of Flowers tent. But there are two. Doors. What the heck? What's going on here? Another red chest. Oh no, they must have miscounted the number of chests I had. Huh. Weird. Wish there was a way to sort her spells so that you could organize them by elements, too. Hmm. 
All right, happy smile obtained. Hmm. Oh no, they attacked me while I was reading the art. Fields of flowers. Okay, now I need to make my way over to that, uh, to the other cave on the other side. Ah. Don't cause me, I hope it doesn't cause me to glitch to the top of that bridge. That'd be really bad. Well, I'm pretty sure the developer thought of stuff like that, right? Right? Oh no. Uh, what? Okay, let's put, take out this guy and then save. Huh. Full recovery. What is this? Okay, seems I need to open that chest that required all the uh, red... Uh, uh, all, all of the CG art first. I'll get back to that chest right now. I'll be right back. Alright, the chest is finally mine. Take. Now we need to find where the, ar where the Arca is, but where? We saw it before. Definitely not here. <laughs> they actually knew you'd try to check it. Okay, we should have the means to activate this one now. Save right here. Probably won't be able to leave until we clear the dungeon, though. I think we can put the orb here. No coming back until you finish the level. Let's do it. Separate slot. Let's find out what's hiding in here and then get uh, an escape. It's quite scary. Let's do this quick, okay? Yeah, this place... It's so... Uh, this place is so evil that... It's not even the story. Who knows what kind of crazy monster Lady Amber and Lord Theo made here. Doesn't matter, we'll kill them all. Say, okay, these guys are the uh, uh, these guys are similar to the ones we fought in the recent story dungeons. They're more powerful. Uh, I didn't give enough agility. I I actually farmed some agility books off screen, but it still wasn't enough to get him to outspeed everyone. What a shame. Oh well, we tried. I guess I'll just have to farm even more agility until I until I am able to outspeed anything, even with my slower members. Oh, I see. This is a one of these puzzles. Identical looking rooms. Hmm. It says first go west. Uh, healing an elixir, huh? Oh no, I guess not. I guess I actually do have to... I guess there, there is a meaning to exploring every path. Whoops, my mistake. Whoa, that was a nice crit. I know I got were common nodes. Oh well. Ah! More of you. I really wish there was some kind of spell or item that would completely uh, allow you to walk right through encounters. After all, there's not much point fighting them when you're already at max level and have all the best gear. Well, I guess there's still some meaning. I can always use their money drops to gave in more uh, speed books. Mm. Oh, I see. You go the wrong way, you get sent back to start. Okay. North. 
Oh, shoot. Okay, the game says to go northwest next. Wait, what? Did I mis re misread that? Oh, no. Let me reload that so I can... Okay, if it's not northwest, then maybe northeast? Huh, weird. Nope. Okay, let's try this path then. No, not that one either. Weird. Then maybe north again. That might be the best solution. Ah. The only direction I haven't used yet is north. Okay, this looks different. There's a bridge now. But which way do I want to go from here? West? I see something- No, it's the same screen. Shoot. I recognize it. How about east? That's no good either. Shoot. Okay, this time we go north twice. There's no other choice. Oh shoot, now this is where it gets confusing. This is where I need to head northwest. Okay, see a linear path now? How are they so fast? Okay, there's a secret chest here. More healing elixir, huh. Is there a save point before the boss? Okay, I see something really nasty there. Alright. See what you're made of, boss. I fought many before you. I probably killed your creator. I am Elamera. I am the loyal servant of Lady Amber, and today I will avenge her death by killing you all. If we can defeat that witch, defeating you should be a piece of cake. Cocky little human, you'll see who's, who's gonna get the last laugh. Get ready. You can't lose in this battle. Make sure to prepare your equipment and items before the battle. Yeah, I'm I'm already pretty good to go. But how tough is this guy really? Kinda strong. Oh shoot. Okay, amplify. Hmm, she doesn't have any good group heals. Master of Magic. There. What's he casting? Oh, snap. He is faster than everyone in the party, and even Diana cannot outspeed him. This is really bad. I may have to break out some actual healing items. Rage. Oh man, the van might actually be able to win us this one. Our swing. Uh, he's blinded, but he doesn't use physical attack, so it doesn't even matter. Oh. 
Amplify. Make us even more powerful. Whirlwind. Not worth it. Ow. Special nut on double buffed intoner. Nice. Rage. Rage is his most powerful move, isn't it? Even when he attacks me, I don't gain much TP from it. Something is seriously mess uh, messed up with the TP uh, balancing. It's like you, the only way to really get your TP up quickly is to spam normal attack or always go to a church ahead of time. Okay, Lang, we're gonna need another one of your specials. Rage! Ooh, that was a good crit at the end. Look at that, 60k! Arg! I can't believe it! But I am not done yet! Seraph is waiting for you at Mount Yadava's Peak. Take th this orb and you can meet her there. If you can beat her, you can call yourself a Grand Knight. Why are you telling me this? A gate is opening. I think that's our way out. But let's grab some chests first. Oh, oh shoot, I bought those already. Curses. Curses. Now I feel like I wasted my money. Everyone else's ultimate weapons, which I have already bought. Oh man, maybe I could just sell these or something. Dang it, I, I should have used that money on speed boosters instead. What was I thinking? Buying them from the store itself. I should not have done that. Oh well, I'll put that a note. I'll, I'll just note in the video description and hope no one makes the same mistake as me. Then again, it's possible that some people won't be able to beat this boss without the ultimate weapons, but no, this boss is pretty easy even on hard mode. They don't need ultimate weapons at all, even the semi ultimates will be good enough. Except for Lang's semi-ultimate. Hers sucks. Save just in case I screw up. Because I pretty much explored this forest as much as I could. Hmm. If only there was a quick exit back. Back to the beginning of this entire cave, that is. Alright, made to the summit of Yavada again. Yeah, that's how you pronounce it. Anyways, everyone's got max gear and stuff, and I also I gave them speed boost and even MP boost to the uh, everyone who's not Risa. I'm already I was already waiting for you. Uh, no hard feelings about killing Amber, right? Prove to me if you're really a grand knight. You can't- okay, so... Give you one last menu option and... Oh no! Ah! She's faster than me, even with my- Oh wow! This is really bad. No way! Just how much- I- I feel like they expected you to do a lot of farming for this one. Holy shit. Risa, you're just our backup item user at this point. Okay, bunch of status effects. Power swing. 
Huh, sh physical attack. Okay, so Risa and Diana are in the most danger. Did she just remove all her statuses? Oh, no. Not good. Van, do something! Yes, do those crits! We need crits! What? 5,000? No way! What's my best- Okay, full revive on Lang. I'm not sure we can win anymore. Boss is ridiculous OP. Damn it, she is both physical and magic, so I can't easily deal with her. This is not going very well. Shoot, I should have invested. I should have invested even more. Even with all my items, this is really a bad situation. Ugh. <sighs> Buffed up again. Oh. Might as well do something special before I die again. Oh no, she can buff herself! How do I remove statuses from the enemy? Deba Frost. Yes, I removed it. That's a start. Amplify. I better have Link save up for her debuff attack. That's the. That might be my best strategy. Shoot, I should have bought better s items. No. Oh, <laughs> Truly the ultimate foe. Also, why aren't you attacking Van, you jerk? Van needs a TP right now. Okay, so. Power swing. No! Oh, finally you attack, Van! Took you long enough. Uh. Ow. Seriously, we don't have any. G Most of our heals are really weak. Huh, healing elixir. Yeah, all of her healing spells are really weak in this game because they don't scale well to your magic at all. So I have no choice but to use items almost all the time. Hmm. 
rage. Crit, dang it. Deep of Frost. Haha. -ha. Ow. <sighs> Come on, attack Diana so she can get some TP back. Jerk. Never attacking the people I want you to attack. Keep everyone topped off. Now rage. It's your best move. Power swing. Oh no, she's buffing herself. Oh no. No. Let Lang get her turn faster, dang it. I should have given her even more speed. These mages are. N you know what? You should just give it a mana water to Van before he runs out. Oh no, we're running. My buffs are falling off. Curses! Hit Diana and get her TV back up to 50, please. Crap. All states. Oh no, wrong one. Raise full and Risa. Seriously. Uh. Nice crit. Oh no. Uh, oh man. Lang. Oof, but it got me back to 50, which is good. You fool, you have triggered my trap card. Oh, wait, seriously, attack Van more. He needs more TP. Ah. I lost my buff advantage. Power swing. Wait, my TP is full. Quickly, Intoner. Nuke. Yes, please attack the. Uh, please attack Van more often. Seriously, he can survive most attacks. Everyone else can easily die in one hit. Oh yeah. I can still use normal buffs. Is so anything here to all stats down? I see. 
There we go. That'll learn ya. Oh, and thanks for the TP boost. Chump. All right, check this out. Amplify. Everyone's got double stats. You are debuffed. Oof. My rage. So close. Probably stock up on more items once I finish this battle. I have no idea how the final boss will compare to this boss. Yeah. Yeah. But now I can buff again. Power swing! Haha, yeah. -ha, victory is mine. Despite your ridiculous stats, I did plenty of farming off screen. And really, what's that experience gain? What? Like, you have to be level 99, uh, you're probably going to be level 99 by the time you reach this boss anyways. Instead of that, they should have given us the ultimate monster node to max out our money. You really are... Take this, and thank you. Love letter. I guess that's it? I think yes. I think so. Love letter, what... Who's... What's this love letter? What does it do? Is it an equipable? What? What did they give me? From the developer. I'll open it up once I'm back in safe territory. I have no idea if uh, if it'll cause a crash if I open it. Yes, this ha stuff like this happens to me uh, happened to me in other games before. Yes. Ugh. That was intense. Way more intense than that previ previous bonus boss. If I didn't up my speed that much, wait, wait, even be able to survive. If it weren't for that, I'd surely die. I, sh I wouldn't be able to keep up with all the debuffing. Love letter from the developer. First, I want to say thank you for playing till this part. I can't believe you uh, collected all the CG, defeated Elamura, the secret boss, and reached the peak of Yadava. Too bad we're bad programming. This is definitely achievement worthy, but we don't know how to program achievements. I swear, we'll, uh, 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 we tried it, but the achievement script either d didn't work or work, but broke some other feature in the game. So please forgive us uh, for that, and thank you for playing until this section. We def uh, uh, we're definitely working on the sequel of the uh, uh, game. Can't wait to see you play it again. This is a very personal message, and not even proofread by our team, written by myself, the creator of the game. I hope even with this bad level of grammar, you can still understand what I really want to say. Oh, so they were aware of it. So thanks for taking the time to write that. Alright, time to end this war. I think I've got enough speed on everyone so we can deal with anything. Is that King Jovich? I've already read your report and I agree with your proposal. We must avenge our generals and attack Mayani province. Our pride is already, uh, 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 has already been attacked enough after we lost in Roche Fort. At least, uh, we must at least be able to regain control of Mayani. Thank you, my lord. I promise I will win this time and regain Mayani province and defeat Emralia. This time we must win. We can't afford another loss. Wait, don't tell me I'm playing as Fio. Lord Fio decided to attack the Kingdom of Miralia after losing to the Kingdom of Virgin Fort. Judging from Miralia's regular strike, it was either a demon. It, it, it seemed easier to defeat. Okay. And the realms knew the attack was only a matter of time. Stupid all scrolling. It's confirmed. They already uh, uh, marched out from Goldie. Just let them go past Trinity Pass, but we need to hold them out, uh, uh, hold them off for a while. 
Lang, are the preparations done? Four outposts outside Vasquez is already uh, have already been built according to your uh, uh, orders. All right, we need to hold them off as long as we can. What is your plan for this battle, Amanda? We need to hold. Okay. Uh, he's not really explaining much other than holding them off. The heck? All right, trust you this time. I think we can win against them. This plan works. Trust me. We've already won before the war started. You really sound like her. Well, then I think there's nothing more I can say to you. Let's pray and hope for the best. Also, for these war sequences, just give us bigger mobs. Uh, 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 bigger but fewer mobs. As in, uh, fewer groups of enemies, but with more uh, in each group. About 200k Aryan troops led directly by Lord Fio advanced from Goldie, attempting to attack the Kingdom of Emralia. Yes, that way our AoEs will actually be put to good use. Like, if we used Rage to take out four guys at a time. While the Emralians numbering only 20k, we're expected to defeat the Aryans somehow. Trinity Pass will become a battleground where Aryan fights the Kingdom of Emralia. Okay. So, what exactly does my team do? Do we just fight off wave after wave of, of like, one person at a time again? Don't worry, we can defeat them. To be continued... Wait, what? You can't just... No! I want to kick Lord Fio's ass! You can't do this to me! That wasn't even a... F that means Lady Amber was technically the final boss. That's disappointing. I was hoping we could take down Fio himself. Huh. Uh, how, that's one way that. Uh, well, there is supposed to be a sequel, but still. I'm not sure if. Uh, I mean, Lady Amber was kind of strong, but I'm not sure she's final boss material. And now I feel kind of dumb tr doing all that preparation just uh, uh, for an actual final boss. Huh. Like, what did we just do? I was really hoping I could see Manda's plan in action to see what he learned from Rash, but no. <laughs> Gotta wait until the sequel. Told me we could learn more about Lord Fio's motivations. And if he'll confront- and how he'll react when Risa finally confronts him face to face. And also, I wonder, will we be able- uh, I wonder if the second game will carry over or save some of the first. Probably not. I'll probably just assume certain things are canon, like the bonus bosses, maybe? Thank you for playing the game. We're playing our game. Okay, so... Just back to the title screen, right? Yup. Hmm. I mean, uh, the mapping was all right, but though I could, though some of the passages could stand to be a little bit wider just to compensate for the fast, uh, 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 for the uh, fast-moving enemies on the map. Translation is definitely the translation is definitely the weakest part. Yeah, hopefully, whoever you have, uh, you, they claim they're going to have a better translator for the second game, but hopefully, uh, but hopefully, they'll have enough money to pay that translator to redo the first game's dialogue, too. Hmm. 
And the war sequences really should be, uh, uh, really should be uh, approached differently. I feel like just uh, uh, fighting enemies in small groups is ju just makes it dragged out unnecessarily. Either make the uh, just fight a very large group of enemies, or uh, just turn it into some uh, sort of uh, sh strategy uh, uh, RPG section. Yeah, the way it's done now seems- it just seems kind of awkward. Oh, well, that's it for Insurgents Chains of Renegade. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, hit the bell icon, and maybe try out this game for yourself.